Hey everybody, this is David. I'm Dylan. And we're gonna play I'm Brad. So we're just gonna jump right into it. Uh, as you can see, I'm still on level one, not cleared. Now, uh, full disclosure, I did kind of clear this level last night, uh, but I chose not to save it. I, this is just some stuff, don't worry about that. Uh, but yeah, I've kind of beat this first level in a way, but I wanted to start from scratch here. So <laughs> first off, I'm noticing a little bit of lag on my end, maybe because we've got like a million apps running and we're uh, screen sharing this over Skype. So sorry about that. So as you can see, I'm a piece of bread on a table. Yep. My goal, it's kind of hard to point out. Oh yeah. Can you see my cursor on this? I think you can. Yep. I uh, there's a toaster right over there. Our goal is to become toast. I think wait, that's wait. the goal of every level. So um, I'm, I'm assuming these things in front of you are like obstacles you have to go on? Uh, yeah, there are a lot of obstacles. Also, up here you see the edibility meter. Um, if that gets to zero, you fail the level, and you want to try to keep it as close to 100 as possible to get a better grade. Okay. Touching the floor rapidly decays that. I don't know why that matters, but it does. And wait, 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 there's wait, also wait. other obstacles that can decay is it that too. Is it 10 seconds till zero on the floor? Uh, I don't know. That's a good question. I don't. I think it's a little bit longer because I've been on the Damn. floor before, and I feel like. But that would be really cool. Um, there's a timer up here. I don't know if that matters, and then there's grip. So this game is hard to control. I'm. I'm getting better at it. I. I don't know if I'd say I'm an expert, but uh, we're gonna. I'm just gonna go ahead and get into it, and I'll talk more as we go along because right. I'm sure people are tired of staring at bread. Yep. Let's so we are uh, gonna move out. So you kind of control by like <laughs> grabbing wherever on the the keypad wherever the thing is. I'm gonna grab this jelly because if you get yourself all uh, sticky with jelly, you can stick to walls. But well, what about the glass? Uh, yeah, we're just kind of humping <laughs> through it right now. <laughs> Don't worry about the glass. Um, so uh, yeah, you have to use the uh, the number pads where with the corresponding numbers on the pieces of bread, and that does each side of it. And then the Q, W, E, and R, which you'll sometimes see pop up, those are if you can grab stuff. So like that's probably asking if I want to grab that glass, or like the W might be for the lid. And you can grab that and move it. Let's flip here and see uh, if that side looks good yet. Oh, it's hard to, it's very hard to play this game. <laughs> All right, so the, we're probably gonna want more than that. So let's flip back. Uh, that was like so much work for like nothing. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of this game. So um, it's very challenging. This is not what I expected. Dylan, what do you think of when, what would you imagine this game would be like just from looking at it and from the fact that it's called I Am Bread? I would think it would just be kind of like the goat simulator aspect where it's a game really about nothing. That's exactly what I was picturing. <laughs> this is not that. Uh, actually, I was pretty disappointed at first. I kind of like it more that I play it. But it's uh, it's not a game about nothing, I would say. It's actually like a lot of like skill and challenge that you have to put into this, uh, even though it probably doesn't look like it. <laughs> the, the Oh, dang it. The maneuvers I'm doing are actually kind of like tough. We gotta get more jelly than that. This may seem pointless, but trust me, the jelly is important. Dang it. Um, so also, you don't want to pick up that bonefish over there because that'll like screw you over. Oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> yeah, I accidentally picked that up. Dang it. This is a game that where you kind of. Uh... All right, forget it. We're just gonna go for it. It's like a game we're watching we'll and it's like, why aren't you just fucking doing it? But like, I'm sure it's much harder than that. Oh yeah, I'm sh yeah. I can't imagine what it'd be like to watch this game because uh, I actually hadn't watched any of it before I downloaded it. It just it's available on Steam. Oh no, we missed. We missed. Uh, oh, okay. shit. One, two, okay. three, okay. four. No, five. it's definitely more than 10 seconds. Dang it. Yep. It's not It's not going all the way. Okay, come on. Flip. Flip. Okay. Come on. Can you ride that skateboard? Yeah, if I can get to it. Flip onto the skateboard. Come on. Uh, you're so close. Dang it. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we're safe. So this is the skateboard route. This is not the route I recommend taking. It's better to get that chair to tip. Uh, I've actually, I've made it to the toaster in kind of two ways, but the first time I made it, I accidentally tipped over the toaster. Don't tip over the toaster. Um, you can actually maneuver the skateboard and ride it all the way over to the toaster and just climb up the wall if you want, but that takes like forever. So we're gonna try to just stick to the wall here. Are we on the right wall? Wait a minute, we're on the back wall, aren't we? As you can see, the camera is not <laughs> a lot of fun. Okay, yeah, so we wanna move back this way. Um, do, you just, do you just click and drag to move the skateboard? Yeah, when you click and drag, it like scoots your bread a little bit. When you're not holding down any of the number pads, uh, it just like you scoot the bread a little bit. So doing this, yeah, it just kind of moves the skateboard a little bit. All right, so we're gonna oh, the skateboard. God. Dang it! <laughs> this looks so horrible. It is. <laughs> Why would anybody want to play this game? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. 
Pretty much. Um, oh, okay, okay, now we're... Oh, crap. Hey, Dylan. Yeah? We're going to restart the level. Okay. <laughs> That's something you'll be doing a lot if you play I Am Bread. Yeah, this game is really different. It's um, not as much, like, stupid fun as I was expecting. It's actually, like, kind of a tough challenge. And I started playing and was immediately, honestly, disappointed because I was expecting, like, Good Simulator. Like, no... Oh, shit. No rules. Just, like, let's go crazy. Yeah. And I played for, like, an hour. I would have actually gave up, like, right away and just been like, forget this. But since I knew I wanted to do a Let's Play, I was like, well, I'll stick with it a little bit, see if I can learn it. And I played for about an hour, and then I turned it off. I was like, that game's stupid. And a couple hours later, I was just sitting around. I was like, you know, but I actually bet I could have gotten a little bit farther. <laughs> <laughs> it's got that, like, shitty, like, I, I, this is a stupid comparison, but it's got that kind of, like, Dark Souls thing. Oh, God. Where, where like, it's so hard, but you know that if you just keep practicing, yeah, you can actually yeah. get better at it. And uh, you can, like, learn all the little tricks and stuff. So uh, there's that. Oh, there we go. That's Oh, damn, good. yeah. Um, Soon, just like Dark Souls, there'll be a whole community dedicating to, like, <laughs> being good at this game. <laughs> I hope so. And then the people who are, it's like a badge of honor to... Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, all right, so we should be good and ready here. Let's... Uh, Man, that worked way better than last time. Yeah, that's... It just depends. Like, even, even with skill, there's, like, some kind of randomness to the game that I don't know exactly how it works and also i have no idea how the mouse works i'm gonna be honest like sometimes you'll like drag and it'll like move correctly like that and other times it like won't and i don't know what the difference is all right so we're, what i was trying to do last time was get onto this chair um Ooh. oh i looks like you might have had it almost all right oh. okay yeah so what you want to do the best route Actually, the best route is probably the skateboard, but it's really slow and takes forever, and it's not fun to watch. So the best route is to um, go, nope, not not that way. Get this chair to tip, uh, and fall backwards, which I'm gonna try to do right now. Oh man, almost. We'll flip again. Dang it! There we go. There oh, we go. There go. All right, all right, and then. There, you can fall between these cracks, so you got to be careful. But you should be able to kind of just chill and let your grip go back up. That's a big thing. It's just like in a Shadow oh, yeah, of the Colossus, because that's a good game to compare this to. You've got a grip yeah. meter, and uh, if if your grip runs out while you're on something, you'll fall onto the floor or whatever. What were you going to say? I didn't even notice the grip meter until you pointed it out. Yeah. That's why you want to get the jelly, because how, uh -oh. how that works is um, when you're on a wall. Um, here, let me try to show it here. You can actually let go for a second. Oh, that didn't work oh, out. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh, usually you can let go for a second, and you'll, uh, you won't you want actually just fall. You'll slide. We might be... Stuck? <laughs> yeah. Damn also, it, we're so close. <laughs> also, I don't know what's going Damn. on with this camera. <laughs> All right, well, hang on. What I can do is I could probably let it slide down a little bit more, and then grab it like that, and then just like go around, maybe. The stupid chair. That sometimes you just get screwed by like random stuff that you didn't really plan on. Um, okay. <laughs> Ooh, that was close. Good save there. So now, if actually, if I let go, nope, that didn't work. Come on, flip up. Come on, flip. Okay. Like you should be able to let go, and then. So yeah, <laughs> for some for some reason, it's not doing the sticky thing on this one, which is going to be a problem, because that's like how you kind of. What is that camera? Angle? I don't know. We're getting a lot of problems that I didn't experience last <laughs> night. <laughs> I was kind of actually talking up this game a little bit, and now I'm, I feel like I'm lying to everybody, so I'm sorry about that. Uh, fucking A. <laughs> I was so fucking confident. I was like, I'm not going to beat this level last night because I know that when I do the Let's Play, I can go into it and just show it off and be, like, really good at it. And then I'll probably, like, fail horribly at level two, but at least, like, I'll show, like, hey, you can use some reasonable skill in this game. And then what happens? Can, does that bread get shorter and shorter each time you do it? Like, just no. like so many times? Okay. No, I don't think so. Um, okay, so we want to get rid of this lid. Dang it. <laughs> get rid of the lid. No, is there, like, any backstory behind why you're a living piece of bread? <laughs> there actually is a story to this game, and it's, like, really ridiculous. I don't actually totally understand it. It's something about you're the world's only sentient piece of bread. I don't remember if it says why, but... Uh, You've decided that you want to take the next step of evolution, which is becoming toast. <laughs> That's why I'm confused about... Okay, hang on. <laughs> <laughs> what is this? Sometimes you can't really control what's happening. 
Um, that's why I'm confused about why the edibility matters because you're. I don't. I wouldn't think that you want to be eaten, but apparently you do. Yeah. I don't know. I don't understand this game, man. I think there's probably some. This is by the people who made Surgeon Simulator, by the way. Uh-huh. Um, but Surgeon Simulator, I feel like, was more fun. This is if you want like higher challenge, potentially higher uh, reward. This is probably more of a game. But uh, if you want more fun, I'd probably stick with Surgeon Sim. But uh, I do think there's maybe some Easter eggs in this game. And I'll show it off here in a second once I finish humping this jelly. Um, I just want to get... If you look uh, up... Thanks, camera. If you look up there... There's a spaceship. Hang on, let me try to angle. Oh, yeah, I the, see it. The angle's not really working for it, but you can kind of see it for a second there while that camera jumps around. And I feel like if you can get up there, that's probably a secret. You want to try to go see what's the spaceship? Yeah, what's let's up do it. with that? All right, well, forget about the toaster. Let's go try to go to space or whatever it'll let me do. Um, probably should have got more jelly to go to space, but fuck it. Come on. Dang it. Okay, no, we're good. We're good. Nope, we're not. We're not. <laughs> Okay, we're going to try to get up the chair. For it's the controls of this are really a bitch. Like they really really are. And dang it, come on. You have to your reflexes have to be like so crazy fast. There's probably people watching this being like, "I feel like I could play this game way better." All right, you do the let's play then, man. <laughs> link yeah. me to link me to your let's play. <laughs> it definitely looks easier than I'm sure it is. Yeah. It's fucking frustrating as shit. I was doing so good last night. I'm so disappointed in myself. I thought for sure I would, like, show off my skills in this game. And I was, it's not letting me stick to stuff, which is a problem. There we go. Come on. Dang it. God damn it. <laughs> We're going to restart again. Yeah, I was going to say, this is restart. I just want to point out again, this is level one, everybody. Uh, we haven't made it to the counter. And it's not easy sailing even once it gets to the counter. So... Yeah, I don't know what else to say. Dylan, what's up? How you doing, man? Pretty good, man. How about yourself? Uh, pretty good. That's good. I, uh, what, the new Terminator trailer came out today. Oh, I didn't even know that was a thing. Uh, the new Terminator? Yeah. You a fan of the Terminator movies? You seen I them? have seen two and the reboot with Christian Bale. Uh, two's great. One of the best movies of all time. Yeah, for sure. The reboot with Christian Bale is not. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I've seen every Terminator movie to date. Uh, the first one's really good. Second one, I think, blows the first one out of the water. Three is a pile of shit. Four is a pile of shit. Five is going to be a pile of shit. Really? So yeah, you've only see, so you've never seen the first one, but you're you're probably familiar with the story from number two. Like, yeah, yeah. It's Sarah Connor. Terminator comes and tries to kill her, but somebody comes and saves her. So in this version, they sent a Terminator back even further in time than the first movie to when Sarah oh, Connor was still time? a little girl. Oh damn it! And uh, that Terminator ended up raising her. For some what? reason. What? And so now she's like a good fighter. And so when Kyle Reese is sent back in the first movie to protect her, it turns out she doesn't need protecting, but he does. But there's also a new Terminator. And there's like two Arnold Schwarzeneggers what? or I something. You lost me. Like, they sent her back when she was a little girl. <laughs> yeah. That's about That's how so everyone confused. feels with this movie. Uh, no one knows what's up. But apparently, is this I like an just, alternate timeline or like what? Yeah, it's it's an alternate timeline because it doesn't tie in or doesn't fit with the f other movies, uh, which is stupid, anyways. You know, just don't make it to begin with, for one thing. Yeah. But um, yeah, it just doesn't make a lot of sense. I just remember when Entertainment Weekly, I think it was, came out with some like pictures and some like, here's what this movie's gonna be. One of the first things they said was, uh, yeah, in this one, Sarah Connor, as a little girl, was raised by Arnold Schwarzenegger Terminator. <laughs> And she calls him Papa or something. And it was like, <laughs> hey, I know the, like, cheesy Terminator's a dad kind of thing worked really well in number two. That's not going to work this time. Nope. Don't try that. And he never called it Papa. Nope. He didn't. <laughs> so. That one does kind of work because it was, like, fit perfectly for that time period. He's just, like, some piece of shit, you know, punk-ass kid. Yeah. He's, he's a, I always think of him as Bart Simpson. <laughs> like, <laughs> legitimately. He's Bart Simpson, yeah. His Terminator does not want to put up with this shit I'm trying to get stuff done. Yeah. That's good. So, yeah, I don't know. I mean, it'll probably... I Did did the last one do well in sales, box office? No idea. I don't know either. So, I don't know if this one will or not. Oh, we're getting risky here. Tip back down. Okay. Yeah, the I guess it's really unfortunate for me on Terminator because 
I've always known Terminator to be a good guy because I've only seen two. Oh yeah, I saw so two it, first too, actually. So it just kind of ruined, I'm sure, the effect of that. Yeah, that was ruined for me too. Although I think I kind of knew, like in the first one, he was bad. So I saw a little bit of the surprise, but yeah, I saw two. I watched it as a TV movie, or mm -hmm. on TV, I guess, not as a TV movie, but uh, long before I ever saw the uncut version. So I saw like the shitty edited version. Yeah, those always suck. Yeah, come on, tip. I wonder Speaking if that's of... that is like ahead. a really common thing. Back in the day, when that's still kind of a thing, we're like the... we saw most of our movies on TV because there's like one of the easiest ways to do it other than going to the video store uh yeah that's true and like for movies i mean there were some movies that like i wasn't allowed to get at the video store mm -hmm. when i was younger because i saw terminator 2 i was pretty young when i saw it because it yeah. was on tv and uh i was allowed to watch that version but yeah r-rated movies when i was a kid like the only way i could watch them was the censored edited version yeah that's where i just wasn't gonna watch them what was the first r-rated movie you saw i don't even know i never really pay attention to ratings when i was young. i i want to say my first was the matrix um was titanic rated r no okay no, not that one pg-13 which is weird considering the tits yeah i, I did see it. titanic when i was younger but <laughs> i watched it uh i didn't watch it in theaters um i watched a friend of mine brought it over i don't know i don't know when did your what, what year did that movie come out uh i think it was like in third or fourth grade that came out okay yeah i remember it being like pretty young but we watched like the vhs you know like the right. two the two vhs yeah he had a switch and my mom it was at my house and my mom came and stood in front of the tv <laughs> during the the naked scene my my parents made me and my brother go behind the couch and we it was when uh those pokemon figures you could battle with just came out uh-huh and so we just went behind the couch and started playing those for the rest of the movie nice <laughs> yeah I, I remember watching that movie as a kid and being so fucking bored yeah me too I uh -oh. love that movie now as an adult, but when I was a kid... I, I haven't seen it as an adult. I have oh, no... I, love I haven't seen it since then. I still have never finished the movie as an adult, though, because I always start off when people start dying. Oh, really? Yeah. Too sad or what? Like, too sad, man. I can't handle it. Uh, yeah, I don't know if I would think that movie is sad now or not. God dang it. That one thing isn't working. That's Ooh. like my that's like my cheat trick. All right. We're not, we're not stuck on the chair yet. We could still come out of this. Yeah. yeah. There we go. Hopefully that thing kicks in because if that doesn't kick in by later, uh, this isn't going to work out well for me. Also, have you ever? S oh, we're God. about to be in trouble. <laughs> oh shit! Oh, shit. oh God, dang it! Oh no! 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 <laughs> okay, we're all right. We're all right. We're oh. almost past the very first obstacle in the game. <laughs> <laughs> Only on our first try, too. Oh yeah, this is definitely first try. What have you ever say? seen the uh, alternate ending for Titanic? No. You should look it up. It's hilarious. What's the alternate ending? Okay, so people still die in the Titanic. It's in the uh, actual world thingy. It's like Rose tries to like throw the jewel overboard or whatever. Yeah. And I think she does it. And then like the main... I forgot. Who's the main Who's the main actor? Leonardo DiCaprio. No, no, no. In the like actual time. He's like the ship captain guy that's on the voyage to look for the Titanic. Oh, I don't know. Whatever that actor's name is. It just like starts like maniacally laughing and she does it or something like that it's like the weirdest thing ever <laughs> you know, i think i have seen that actually it's really funny it sounds, it sounds like something i watched on youtube all right so we're, we're up on the counter now we made it i love how everybody probably imagined this is like just a fun game to watch for let's plays and this is like the most shitty game to watch yeah like i can't imagine this being much fun so those are ants over here you don't want to touch the ants because they fuck up your bread i thought those are ants i just couldn't tell because they weren't moving uh, they're moving like really oh, there you go. kind of erratically. It's kind of hard on my thing because it's pretty fuzzy on mine. And... All right. By the way, I'm saying fuck the spaceship. We're going for the toast. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we're uh, going to try to get over the refrigerator here. We're <laughs> going to try. We're getting. I, I don't know what that is in there. Crisps or something? I guess. Uh... Oh, is that pistachio? It looks like pistachios. Oh, maybe. But they're like, I don't know. It's really hard to tell because like everything on mine is really fuzzy. Oh, well, it doesn't look that much better on mine, so. <laughs> but I guess if you if you want to be really entertained and find out what they are, you could always watch this Let's Play when it's done, because I'm sure this is going to be great to watch. That's true. 1080p. Man, that sticky thing is really not working. Maybe, I mean, the toast looks sticky as hell to me. It's kind of, I guess it's working for a second, so that's better than nothing. Maybe they patched it since last Man, what if you get inside the, ch the chips? Uh, oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Stick, okay. I just want to come home to see my bread doing this. <laughs> I think at some point, if you take too long, somebody might come back. Because it says something when you start out, like, 
oh yeah, you know, this guy's got an appointment and he might be back. But then it never warned me. The first time, or one of the times when I got to the thing, I took Dude. like 13 minutes. Dude, I hate to point this out, but I think we can make it to that spaceship. Shit. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, what were you saying about spaceship? Oh, uh, nothing. I didn't say anything. <laughs> you, were so, you look like you were so close to that wall. I was like, I think we can swing over there. Uh, yeah, that's uh, not, not working anymore. out. Not anymore. All right, well, at least I just want to get to the fucking toaster. I'm so mad that I got so good at this last night, and then it's I'm just fucking it all up. All right, we got to try the sticky thing. It didn't work. So you don't want to be discovered by the person coming over there. I think. But that person's going to eventually come home. Yeah. And be like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Why is there toasty here? <laughs> <laughs> Everything is fucked up in my house. There's things knocked over. The jelly's destroyed. <laughs> There's a chair tipped over. And somebody made toast. Toast. It didn't even. Someone it. put someone put bread with jam already on it in the toaster, which would ruin the toaster. <laughs> yeah, what's up with that? <laughs> Man, I I can't believe that sticky thing isn't working. That's like my whole strategy, dude. I fucking a. Maybe it doesn't work on certain surfaces or something. Maybe so. I don't know. I think we might be screwed. I think I might be about done playing this game. <laughs> I was hope what my plan for this let's play was like fuck it we're going this way. Um we will uh I'll I'll easily like trounce this first level and then we'll move on to the next level that way I'll get to show off two levels and I'll also show off like how skilled I am. How's that I, out? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty well. <laughs> but seriously like this fucking grip thing like that's how I was, like, doing the whole game. Because how it would work is, like, if your grip was running out and you had the sticky stuff, you just let go. And it would, like, stick you there. And it would, like, recharge. To get up a fucking surface without... God that, damn it. And now I'm fucking, impossible. like, stuck on here. So that's great. Like, you can't even... How are you even supposed to make it to the top without your grip running out? That's that's what the jelly's for. Like, it's supposed to... Yeah, that's to... what I'm saying. Like, if that doesn't work, like, there's just nothing you can do. Yeah, there really isn't. I mean, if you're fucking, like, fast and accurate, I guess... Because I'm sure there's people legitimately that are like speed running this game already. I hope so. It was sliding a little bit slower there, but still, I mean, it was like completely sticking before. God damn it, son of a fucking bitch! All right, we're gonna try one more time. <laughs> Dude, you're not toast. You're not toast at all. <laughs> all right, we're gonna try one more time. We want to try the skateboard method. Yeah, let's go skateboard. Let's do this. It's going to be boring as shit, but I mean, this this hasn't been that exciting what's in that? What's in that tub thing in the center? Uh, Butter. It's and butter? I don't know what that does. I feel like I'd make you slick it, slicker, wouldn't it? That's what I feel like, too. Because, like, you can tell, like, it sticks to you, but, like, I don't know if that's supposed to be advantageous in any way or not. What if you uh, did jelly and butter, dude? I don't know. It seems too risky. Maybe like I don't. I want to be, be sticky. Delicious. I don't want to be slippery. You'd be one delicious piece of toast, though. Well, that's true. There is that. There's also, like, little nuts or something that you can get on you, but I can't. The problem with this jelly is I can't tell if it's getting on me. I think it is. I mean, I would assume it is. You're right on top of it. Yeah, but, but you know. The, the game's going to say the game looks so <laughs> shitty. This, see? <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> that's not about right. It's because some of the glass gets in the way, and, like, it won't absorb through the glass. So you kind of have to, like, scoot the glass out of the way. I wouldn't bother with the jelly, especially since it didn't work last time. But if it does work, that will get us there eventually. We just we need to figure out what we're going to talk about forever. What's uh, <laughs> um, what's going on? Um, I'm uh, nothing really, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> In a way, I kind of do want to like play this game more and like get better at it. I'm really Although, tempted to maybe buy it just to figure out just to. Just to learn your struggle. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, man. If, that's if, if nothing else, it's worth it for that. Because I think a lot of people might watch this. It, well, I don't think a lot of people watch this because nobody watches our Let's Plays. But I think anybody who watched this and didn't play the game will be like, I could do that. Yeah. And if nothing else, play the game just to see if you're right. Because you won't be. <laughs> it is so much weirder and harder than it looks. And the controls, I just I don't totally understand them. It's really yeah. the mouse part of it. Like, I... I logically get the, like, you know, push one to, like, stick your that side to the ground. Hmm. But, like, the way the mouse controls work is really bizarre. Is there, like, just no, like, instruction manual on how everything works either? Oh, no. Absolutely not. <laughs> of course. But, I mean, that's kind of how Surgeon Simulator was, too. Like, it just drops you in. But I feel like a lot of things just made sense in Surgeon Simulator. 
Like, yeah. even though it was really hard to move the hands around, you could quickly learn the logic of it. Well, I feel like also stopping and restarting in Surgeon Simulator was not as detrimental to It wasn't like... as frustrating. It was still yeah. kind of fun, because, like, even if you had to start over, it wasn't going to be, like, a rage thing. It was just like, right. oh, you know, I, like, poked a guy's eyes out or whatever. It was fun in its own, like... Unique I can see you getting way. all the way close to the toaster and still falling after we start. And just uh, yeah, you should have you should have heard me when uh, I made it to the toaster and knocked it over. <laughs> <laughs> I was so mad. So um, we're on the skateboard, but now we're in for a long haul because you there's no like skateboard control, so you have to like slowly like shift it over. Oh my god! <laughs> so there's gonna be a lot of this. Um, I might cut. I'll, I mean, I'll probably cut this video down anyway. So I could like manipulate the skateboard more. But uh, we're just going to go for it because it's going to be too long of a process if we don't. So, got to watch out for that cat litter, though. It's not extra Oops. bonus? No, I don't think. Well, I don't know. I've never landed in the cat litter. I doubt it's a bonus. Okay, come on. Land. Okay. Nope. <laughs> okay. 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 Come on. Flip up. Get off the floor. Get up. Okay. Okay. The, the thing does not appear to be working, so this might this might be it. I need that sticky thing to work. Come on, flip up. Okay, stick. God dang it. I don't know why that's not working. Like, th there's no way to climb if that's not going to work. I don't know if it's just glitched. This game isn't early access. This isn't a full release. Oh, okay. So maybe that's part of the problem You're here. You're so close. You're so close. I know, but the GURP's going to run out. Here, I'm going to try to... I'm going to try to... Nope. Damn it. All right. This might... This... God dang it. Flip up. Flip up! Come on! No, you're gonna run out. I know, I can't, I can't. Flip! I'm not, my head's in my hands. I'm not even looking at it. Dude, you're not fucking toast. <sighs> Last night, I got in the toaster and I started getting toasted and I said, now I'm gonna quit so that tomorrow I can do this quicker and show off how skilled I am at this toast game and then we can go to level two. I was in the toaster, and I decided to quit because I thought I could beat the level easily again after that. I'm never going to get back in that goddamn toaster. Well, on the bright side, your delicious is 1.75. We're done with this fucking video.